It's good to see y'all again. Today I have my glasses on. I'm talking smart. I'm gonna roll up my windows because birds are annoying. What I plan for is to reach monetization by the time my birthday hits. Reason being, I lost my previous job. It was due to layoffs, not because I was fired or anything, because the business I was working for, if you didn't watch the video before on how I got into pharmacy or how I got my certification, you could go back, click on it, or I'll put it somewhere, like right there. I worked there for roughly six months. To be honest, that job was really nice. Like I could call off whenever I can say I'm going out of town and they would have someone to cover me. And that was probably the best position I was in for a job, but I did end up not being able to keep the job because the business closed down. Oh yeah, I keep saying the business, Rite Aid. Rite Aid closed and Rite Aid is going out of business slowly. So I have to, you know, I'm constantly looking for work. And plus I love vlogging. I love vlogging. So I would like to, you know, have people to upload it to, have people talk to me in the comments or just have, you know, give something for you guys to watch. I would like to set a more entertaining environment. I try to entertain, but I did write down some things that I would like to do to reach um, monetization. Because I've watched a lot of videos on monetization. I watched this one lady, she was like 50 years old and she was like, oh, I got monetized in 10 weeks. And I was like, dang, that's, you know, it's not a long time. And the thing is, is what I'm going to explain, it's going to make sense. It's not, it's not as hard as it seems. These are three ways that I'm going to try to reach monetization. Staying consistent with these things, it, it's going to improve my uh, goal. So let's, let's, let's get these three. So consistency, uh, posting Wednesdays and Fridays twice a week. So Wednesdays and Fridays are like perfect times for me to post just because my girlfriend works those days and I'm not working. When we're both off, that's when I kind of like to record, especially when we do something. Like if we go out for a trip or we go do something, that that would be a nice time to vlog the moment and then edit, post. And on the days that she's working or that she we're off and we're not doing anything, I can still use that time to edit. So consistency twice a week until my birthday in a, about June, July, August, September, October, November, five months. So five months, I'm going to do that. And if it goes good and we reach monetization by that time, then I'm just going to probably stick with the schedule. But we'll see. We'll see where it goes. We'll see what happens. So that's number one. Number two is editing improvement. Um, I'd like to improve one thing in each video. I'd like to improve Mother. I'd like to improve one thing in each video. If that's how I change the color grade or adding in sound effects cuz humans like those. I know you guys like sound effects. I know you guys like What, what the dog doing? doing? You feel me? Like I I, I under uh, you know, add some comedy relief to the video. <laughs> so I'm going to start adding in those. The thing is I don't know how to implement it in my video. It's kind of like hard to implement some sound effects. Not like a lot. Like I'm not trying to add like hella because that just doesn't make sense. Like, I you know everybody's going to get tired of it. Yeah, that's one thing I would like to try to do. Add some comedic relief. And especially the music aspect. Like, how am I going to find music to fit the scenario? Because it's kind of hard to find music to fit scenarios that would basically play in my head. Because I just, I can't picture... I don't know. It's it's hard. It's hard to choose a specific song. So that's number two. Number three is engagement. Engaging with followers by applying what's said in the comments and collecting ideas on what video will be uploaded next and how to improve engagement. I would like, you know, to hear back some feedback from you guys. I uploaded twice this week. If you guys have any, like, ideas or you just want to say what's up, like, you know, I'm a real person, bro. Like, I know you're a real person, too, if you're watching. So, don't don't be shy. Don't be shy. If I reach monetization by my birthday, that would be pretty nice. Because 
honestly, I would love to be consistent in posting YouTube videos, day in my life vlogs, you know, do some fun stuff like going on trips, trying this food, trying things from different places, going to a concession stand in Japan, you know, going to uh, convenience stores in Japan and trying their foods. My girlfriend is into that and I 100% would love to do like travel vlogs and taking trips to like the Cayman Islands or because I've been watching not even going I've been watching like Kelly Wakasa and to be honest I like his vlog style I like how he is able to change the mood and know like and I don't know what he uses for his music but I kind of would like the same vibe that'd be nice but yeah that's my plan on how I'm gonna reach monetization by my birthday It'd be crazy, because I'd even have a birthday upload. Like, I'd upload, bro, like, and the thing is, is once I build a monetization, I think I would be more comfortable in filming myself, because I'm doing it for a reason. It'd be cool to have that as a profession. Like, oh, I record myself. Of course, there's a lot that goes behind the scenes, like editing and all that, but at the same time, it's what I do. It's what I do for a living. Let me know if you're, like, a small YouTuber, and you want to build your confidence in recording because to be honest i, I be in this car I, I meet y'all in this car all the time this is where my confidence is it's in being alone i like to talk to you guys alone rather than talking in front of someone and the thing is, is i think when i build that monetization and that i do this for an audience that's where i'll build the confidence in being able to record alongside my girlfriend and having her hold the camera and record me yeah, plus another thing i tried to get into was tiktok i don't like tiktok the only reason i don't like tiktok is because it's just there's a lot going on it's it's hard to build an audience that's gonna go back and watch you to on my this is how i feel i don't like the viral aspect i like the aspect of building an audience and building a community that you can that you could talk to. That's the only reason why I don't like TikTok. If you guys are enjoying the content, don't forget, hit the like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video on Thursday. Oh, no. Friday. Jeez. Friday. I'll see you guys Friday. All right, y'all. Peace.